Hey guys, so I just got back from, um, like, strength training thing. Um, so my hair is, like, natural, and it's a mess. It's Wednesday, and I love Wednesdays, and I'm hoping you guys now love Wednesdays, and if you don't like Wednesdays, then maybe you can just watch my videos and I can just cheer you up on your Wednesday. This week's theme is, like, five back-to-school beauty products and five back-to-school non-beauty products that are like essential so we're just gonna get started my first I'm gonna kind of go in order of like how I would put them on so first I have a concealer and I have this is an essential because if you're like up until like I don't know What's the latest I've been up doing? Like, essay or something. Like, 1 a.m., I think. Um, you're not going to get that much sleep because I wake up at 5.30. So if I go to bed at 1 and I wake up at 5.30, I feel like 2, 3, 4, 5. That's like four and a half hours of sleep. So I'd be like... Do I have to get up? The next morning. So I would need a concealer so bad. I would have the biggest bags under my eyes it's insane so this is the boing concealer and i've hit pan on this and it kind of sucks that i've hit pan but whatever i'll get over it and i'm in the shade 01 and it's an industrial strength concealer and it is so good and then you need a powder because but you have like redness so you just want to like kind of cover that up MAC Mineralized Skin Finish, and it kind of just makes you look more awake in general. So, mine's really, really messy, and I don't know why, but that's basically what it looks like. It's the best powder ever, and I use this, like, every day. And I've had this since... Now that I meet One Direction. I forget when I met One Direction. Oh, that's not good. It was back in, like, May. April or May. And it, it can be used for a long, long time. Let me just tell you that. This, not these. This is the color tattoo by Maybelline and Bad to the Bronze. I got the bronze. Yeah. Like that, and I've used quite a bit of it. But anyways, you take it on your finger, and then you put it on your eye. And it looks like you spent forever on your eyeshadow. I definitely recommend this, and it comes in a ton of different colors, so if you're into wearing colored eyeshadow like me, um, I also have the purple and the bright blue ones, so I wear those too. Next is a mascara, and I use mascara for those days where I don't feel like doing absolutely anything. This is the Mega Plush Volume Express by Maybelline. This is my all-time favorite mascara at the moment, and hopefully it will be for a while. The wand scared me when I first opened it. I don't know why it reminded me of like a sea urchin, but... Yeah, I really like this. It's like a gel formula, and the brush can, like, bend, so I don't even know how to describe it, but it is so, so good, and it stays on all day, so you don't even really need a waterproof, because I don't really see a difference with waterproof unless you're, like, swimming, or, like, you're sweating or something. I don't really see a difference with that, but, yeah, and I like the color of the packaging. It's so pretty. It reminds me of Aquamarine, the movie. So then I have a lip gloss, and every girl needs that lip gloss that they can just carry, and they can apply, like, whenever. So, you know, it kind of has to be a little bit neutral, so that way it matches, like, every outfit. Like, you can't have, like, a purple one. Like, that just wouldn't work out. I got this in a pack for Christmas. Um, it came with five shimmer glosses, um, and most of them were, like, kind of neutral colors, like pinks, and then there was, like, a bright red. But this is like my favorite because you can put on basically any color lipstick before and then if you put this on over it will kind of tone it down if you think it's too bright and it just adds shimmer. So I love this. It's like a peachy corally color. It's kind of showing up more pinky on camera. But let me tell you guys this thing is like amazing and it has gold shimmer in it so it just makes everything so pretty. And it's like the golden, what's that thing called? That Dorothy walks down like the golden river, the golden sidewalk, I don't know. The golden, I'm pretty sure it's called like the golden sidewalk. So next I have my non-beauty products and I'm just going to be honest with you guys. This is like my favorite part because 
as much as I love beauty, I love sharing my non-beauty products too. First is a book because if you have one of those annoying teachers that they give like pop quizzes and stuff, and then they're like, Okay, since you finished your test, you can now like go read one of our textbooks since you don't have a book of your own. And then you have to read like your US world history textbook, and then you're just like, and then you get in trouble for sleeping in class, but it's all the teacher's fault for making you read that, so always keep a book with you. And then the next is like Tic Tacs or Mints or Gum. I like live on this stuff, I will tell you guys, because my stomach is always like in the middle of class, it's like, Nina, you're hungry. And then I'm like, I hope nobody heard that. And then it goes, once again, and then everybody stares at me, and I'm like, I'm like, I'm not even hungry. So, I'll pop one of these in my mouth. I always have Tic Tacs or mints or gum with me at one point or another. And I'm allowed to have these in school. I don't know about you guys, but I can have Tic Tacs, mints, and gum. So, yeah. Another alternative is water because your stomach can trick you. Like, if you think you're hungry, but you're really not, then you should either have, you should try having water first. And then if water doesn't work, have like, like a gum or a mint or something because sometimes you're just thirsty and your stomach is trying to think you that trick you into thinking that you're hungry. And then sometimes your stomach is trying to trick you that you're hungry but really you just need like the taste of something in your mouth. Then the next is an iPod or an iPhone or whatever you have that plays music. Um, hopefully not a CD player because I feel like that would be kind of embarrassing to carry around school. Then the last thing is like a girl's first aid kit. Now this is the thing that you should carry around for your girl. Ouch! Flower Power Deluxe First Aid. And then it has like these band-aids. So those are all like band-aids and they're all in here. So normally I'll just take some out and but I just wanted to show you like they like come in packs like these. This is my mini first aid kit. And this thing is just from Bath and Body Works. A pad, a hand sanitizer, a tampon holder, but there's not tampons in here. I keep Advil in here. I have volleyball practice every day after school. So like if my ankle's hurting or something's hurting um, before practice, I'll take it, or after practice, I'll take one of these. If I have a headache during the day, I'll take one of these. Um, if my friends have a headache or a stomach ache or something, I'll get them one of these. I have a tampon. Okay, every girl needs one of these, because if you're gonna see your crush, Bob, in, like, second period, and you have, like, a third eye coming on, you need one. You, you need this. This is the Clearcell Ultra Rapid Action Treatment Cream, vanishing four hours, visibly reduces spot size and redness in as little as four hours. Then I have Neosporin because I always have like blisters, um, whether it's like mostly on my feet from my shoes. That was all I have for Wednesday and I hope you guys really enjoyed Wednesday because Wednesday is the best day of the week because you get to see me. If you kick me, then we can be friends. We can be like heart friends all the time, but if not, we can only be heart friends on Wednesday. Take your pick. My links will be in the down bar if you guys want to talk to me and I will see you in a week. Bye guys.